hello everyone welcome back to my channel again today and guys today our topic is did you tried already you know did you experience already try to update your OS on your laptop and there's something wrong happen on your Windows like you cannot boot already on Windows and it's only stuck on a Dell logo so that's our topic for today guys and we have a laptop here Dell this is a laptop of my friend and the reason why he just gave me this so he just asked me to fix this one because if you try to open this laptop and it's only stuck on a Dell logo you can put it on Windows so uh, we're going to find out if how can we fix this one we're going to troubleshoot this step by step and so that's why we can find out what is the cause of this problem okay okay guys here we go and this is the things that we're going to need if we're going to open this laptop here a long nose a small screwdriver with small magnet here so that's why we can't lose the uh, screws because the screws is very small and the brass okay so let's go guys so the first thing we're going to try is we're going to open this one and as you can see guys the battery is still in here so we're going to power on this one there you go powering on and look at that guys it's still stuck on the logo and it's only half here so uh, we're going to power off again and try to remove the battery okay I just removed the battery and we're going to connect this one directly to the adapter here that is connected to our power here so we're going to try to put some so there you go it's plugged directly to the adapter and I removed the battery and let's try to open it again oh still the same guys the error is still the same it's still stuck on the Dell logo okay so turn off and remove this power here and I think the third one at uh, the second one guys is we're going to remove this keyboard here so let's try to remove this keyboard so maybe this is the cause of the problem so let's try I hope okay we're going to remove this one So okay guys I just removed the keyboard and we will try it again without keyboard so I'm going to plug it directly here and we will try to open it again oh my god still the same guys I think I need to open this one so and I will try to remove the memory the one of this memory here maybe this is the cause of the problem and he's got a two memory guys look at that so we're going to try the uh, first one first so that's why we can check aha uh -huh, plug it oh my god guys yeah, still the same so let's try again the other one plug it again and we're going to open it again oh 
oh my god it's still the same guys it's still stuck on the logo uh, we already tried to memory and I think we're going to open this one okay This is how to open the Dell Enspiron. The model of this laptop is Dell Enspiron N4050. Yeah, you need to pop up this thing here. So that's why you can remove this up this uh, cover here. So there you go. I just remove this one. So we're going to remove the hard drive. This is the hard drive guys. As you can see this is the hard drive so we're going to remove the hard drive I so I just opened it already guys and we need to remove the hard drive so I think this is the reason why so let's try and let's try to put it back without the hard drive and let's try to power it on so the reason why I need to uh, put it back this one because the ribbon is you need to put it the ribbon back so that's why you can power it on so okay guys let's try to power on it again without hard drive there's no hard drive here I just removed the hard drive this is the hard drive so Let's try to plug it again and power on. Oh my god, still the same. What happened to you? So our last option guys is we're going to remove this CPU heatsink and the power and the fan and we're going to replace the thermal paste, okay? So we have a thermal paste here, so we're going to use this one. So first, we're going to remove this thing first, okay? So I already cleaned up all this, uh, I already cleaned this thing here. So now guys we're going to apply this thermal paste here, okay. 
so ah oh my god sorry for that so that's it thermal face just apply it a few one thing like that and here also there you are so we're going to put this thing back here okay guys we're done cleaning up this uh, cpu heatsink and i already apply a new thermal paste so let's try so i'm gonna without hard drive and i just remove the bios here and reset the bios and there you go i just removed the bios also and the hard drive and with the memory here so let's try to put this thing here so that's why we can power it on put the power cord here there you go all right let's try to plug it in here oh my god i hope this thing will work already on the count oh what happened what's the kind of error here the memory error Oh, the bias error. So let's try it again. My god, still not working. So I think the motherboard is already broken. oh my god still the same guys what happened to this laptop so let's try to put some keyboard here Oh my god, still not working, bro. Oh. So, I'm very sorry, guys, but uh, it's still not working, guys. I already done all the possibilities that I know. So, uh, it's still the same, guys. So, I'm so sorry for that. I think the problem is already the motherboard. So, I think we need to uh, bring this to the shop so that's why they can reheat the G 
chips here uh, as of now guys we're going to end this video so uh, thank you for watching uh, I, I hope you learn how to basic uh, step by step troubleshoot your laptop if uh, this is also happened to you but I already saw some videos on YouTube that they also you know uh, having this kind of problem and they solve it while they removing the keyboard the battery and sometimes that's the only the problem but and I think this one is the motherboard so nothing to do with that guys so I'm so sorry and thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and thank you so much for watching okay bye